you are a music teacher. Yes, and, and I run a music school. Tell me why you decided to make this your life's work. I was raised by two parents who were music teachers. As little as I remember, I was always being carried around to their music rehearsals. So by the time I was five, I decided I wanted to grow up and be a music teacher. There are a lot of music schools in the San Francisco Bay Area. Tell um, me what makes you guys different. I like the teachers to use what we call progressive materials. The things they incorporate is the brain learns best when it learns one thing at a time. Boom, boom, they have fast progress. And then they're encouraged. We're only gonna use progressive materials because I care about the students and their families who are paying them money. They should get fast results. I am with you, I am with oh, you. Value-based music lessons. Okay. Great. This is a great school with so many different rooms, yes, too. I love how every single one has a different style, a different aesthetic. Um, I mean, you're a little interior designer. I've got uh, 10 rooms here, but you don't even know it from the outside. But I did start with three. My idea was to have an artistic environment, so not only would the kids feel like they're in a place that's inspiring, but also the teachers. They're there for five, six hours, and imagine just being stuck in a closet, which is often what happens. Do you have a place for them to actually invite their friends and family? Yes, I do. I have my own recital hall, and it's set up with 46 chairs. All the children are encouraged to dress up. Mm -hmm. The teens are encouraged. We have teen night, so they're encouraged to dress up. And then we have adult lounge night. Oh, that sounds we, fancy. Oh, it's where we have cheese and wine, mm. and they can come in here and watch the adults perform. Wow, that sounds great. Hey, I have an idea. How about we just have a short lesson? I'm in. Better world music awaits you. Feel free to contact us soon. <laughs>